Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I have my April empties here. My room was a hot mess behind me. I had a very unproductive day. Besides the fact that I went to Harmon's, got a new Fitbit. I got the uh, Charge 2. So if you want me to do a review on the Charge 2 sometime in May, let me know in the comments. I did one on the Charge HR, the original. Um, and I was able to give you a little background on it. Now this one is different than the Charge HR. This has more features and other things you can do with it. I was just playing around with it right now. And it is, you know, different. So if you want me to do a review on it, let me know in the comments. Um, so yeah, but other than that, so we're going to be doing my April empties. So I filled this bag a lot this month. So there's things in here that are beauty and not beauty. So, um, first thing I'm getting rid of, well, I just finished, is my Turby Twist. I have it in uh, Baby Blue. I love this guy, but I've had him for so long that he's just getting gross now. So I'm just going to toss him. I bought a new one, and Turby Twist are life. I finished two conditioners of the uh, Garnier Fuji's Hydro Recharge. I love this product, but unfortunately they no longer sell it at my Harmon's. I finished a VO5 Herbal Escapes in Kiwi Lime Squeeze, and I finished a Skin to Mid Moisturizing Shave Gel in Island Berry Breeze. I use these two to shave my legs. I varied the scents, so it's not really like I love or hate between any of the scents, I just kind of varied it all up. I finished a L'Oreal Pure Moisture Hydrating Conditioner. I love this product. As you can tell, I go through a lot of conditioners. I have a lot of hair, so... I finished up a Scrubbing Bubbles Bathroom Cleaner. It kills 99.9% .9 of viruses and bacteria. I love this product. I have like two more. I spray it in my shower on the glass and on like the bottom of the tub and on the walls <clears throat> every time I get out of the shower. Now that I shower at the gym, so um, and when I shower at home it's not as often. So if I shower at home every day it would probably be every other day. I finished a Swiffer's. Uh, cotton rounds. This is an 80 count. My mom has been taking them and throwing the contain throwing the plastic away. So I finished more, but she's thrown them away on accident. I finished my Tazerac cream and my benzoyl peroxide cream. These are both from my dermatologist for um, post Accutane acne. I finished a botanical mask. I don't know this brand because it was ripped off the top. Maybe it's Bonvent. I got this in an Ipsy or a Birch box. I finished a Tarte Refresh Eyes Maracuja Waterproof Eye Makeup Remover Wipes. I hated these with a passion. I don't even want to look at them anymore. I'm so happy I'm finished with them. I was using them for swatches to get rid of them. I finished a Marcel 3-in-1 Microcellar Solution. I absolutely love this product. I use it on the days where I would shower in the morning and I want to clean my face at night or on the days that I felt like I needed an extra clean on my face before I went to bed, even if I did shower at night, maybe I went out and got ice cream or went out and got dinner or something, I would use this. I love that product. I finished a Devo, Devo hair, hair Wellness. This was a Lemongrass Detangler. I love this product. This was amazing in my hair. And then I finished a Night Your Mother's Way to Grow Leave-In Conditioner. This was great as well. Don't know if I'd purchase a full size, but they were really great products if I ever did. I finished a Glade Sense and Spray Refill and Wine Breeze. I have like a thousand backs up, backup of those. I love that. I finished a sample of the All Hair Content Sheer Transform Facial Cream. Now I'm highly considering buying a full size of this product. This is the second time I've used it. The first time was from Influenza, which I received for reviewing and testing purposes. And then I got it in a Sephora and I absolutely love this product. It's so light on the skin. It's so moisturizing. I might buy it for the summer. I might cave and actually go get it. I finished a um, e.l.f. pen, a makeup remover pen. You can't even, you don't even know this e.l.f. I've used it so much. And the tip is all dirty and black. This was a really great product to remove mistakes maybe with a wing eyeliner and things like that. I finished, well I didn't really finish, I'm just kind of throwing this out, a eyelash curler. Now when I was in high school I went through this phase and I threw away all my makeup and I got new stuff. And this was one of the new things I got in high school back in like when I was 
before I was dating my fiance, back when I was in like ninth or 10th grade, I bought this and how old are you, ninth or 10th grade? 14, 15 years old. So that was like almost 10 years ago, give or take eight to 10 years ago. So I'm getting rid of that. I am getting rid of a brush head for my um, uh, Olay facial cleanser brush. I finally bought a new one today, so I'm getting rid of this guy. I've had him for quite some time. And I finished up two um, of the car air fresheners. I think this is Febreze, and it might be like rain or something like that. I'm not 100% sure, but I have a um, Hawaiian breeze, I think, in my car right now. Um, and that's everything now. This is all empty. So that was my trash for the month. I will try to finish up some makeup products for the month of May since I have been wearing mascara a little bit more and they're starting to dry out since some of them are quite old. Also, let me know if you want me to do an Essence haul. The beauty brand Essence. My, um... Harmons just got Essence and I was looking at their stuff today when I went there and I was like yes I need to do a haul but if you guys don't want me to do a haul I'll still buy the stuff and I'll just enjoy it myself but if you would like me to do a haul let me know in the comments Essence is something that you also can get at uh, Ulta but unfortunately there's not like a local Ulta where I can just run like the mall by me has Sephora, they opened up an Ulta, but the parking lot over there is like a hot mess to try and get into. So my Harman's has Essence. I really want to try it. So let me know in the comments if you want me to do a review of my Fitbit uh, Charge 2. And if you want me to do a Essence haul. Strictly Essence, the beauty brand. But other than that, guys, that is all for my empties for the month of April. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Till next time, guys. Bye.